Shivaroor is getting us more details on that story. Shiv joins us live. Shiv Israel has, of course, released the footage of Hamas rockets targeting civilian buildings. You yourself were there, caught in a rocket attack. Hamas is clearly not backing down, and hellfire continues. Indeed, uh, you know, most of those rockets are targeted at civilian areas, uh, and uh, uh, the, the fact that uh, uh, that the Hamas continues to have the capability to fire rockets uh, and not just uh, you know small range rockets but long range rockets uh, is perhaps one of the most alarming things uh, you know i'm here in tel aviv which is a good uh, 80 to 90 kilometers away from the gaza strip uh, there were rocket there were two rocket attacks yesterday including one late last night uh, you know while i was in my hotel uh, i met a journalist who had come down from haifa which is the northernmost city of israel uh, there were some rocket uh, alerts uh, there as well and the iron dome had got activated which means that the these are no longer just the Al Qasim rockets uh, that are being used. The Hamas is using the Iranian uh, rockets, which are, uh, you know, much more capable, much more advanced, uh, and uh, uh, appear to be beyond the range of uh, Israeli airstrikes. So this is definitely alarming. Uh, you know, I can tell you that after a week in Israel, uh, uh, rocket alerts, rushing to bunkers, has become second nature. So you can imagine what it's like for common Israelis to, uh, you know, they, they just hear the siren and they dash into their bunkers uh, and rocket shelters, which are there everywhere. I can see one from where I am as well, very close by. So uh, uh, the the rocket threat continues to be there. Every Every single day, and there's an app that you download over here called Zofar, which gives you, you know, live, uh, you know, live updates and uh, uh, alarm flashes on rocket sirens, etc. And that app is pinging the whole day here in Israel. Every, every, like five minutes, there's a rocket siren going off somewhere in Israel, if not the place where you're at. When we were in Holit yesterday, there was a rocket alert while we were there. We saw three interceptions right above our head. So this is, uh, 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 this is alarming. If after 20, 21 days of uh, airstrikes and bombing, uh, you know, Hamas is able to maintain that rocket uh, capability, uh, 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 it says something about how they've managed to protect their offensive power in the face of a relentless uh, you know airborne campaign against them so uh, you know like someone was saying this is not some ragtag terrorist outfit that Israel is dealing with this is practically a quasi military that's able to defend while continuing to attack thanking you Shivarul joining us with the very latest on that story